Hi everybody, this is Doll Dazzler and welcome to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be sharing with you guys some more dolls from my doll collection. This is Star Barbie and her friend Tracy. These are kind of like, um, I think they're labeled as the high school teen doll. Um, they have a lot of the characteristics of, of Barbie, but they are not um, like in that they're not listed as Barbie's friends so um, these were made um, in 1979 by Mattel and uh, Star doesn't have on her original clothing um, but Tracy does so um, this would be the outfit um, and I don't even know I don't even know if really this is Tracy's outfit, if she had the same outfit that Star would have had, but um, this is definitely uh, what Star should be wearing, and it quite possibly could be her original outfit as well. I haven't done a lot of research on the Star Barbie. Um, I just got them because I like Star. I had purchased both of these in an antique store um, together, and um, I wish I had been able to find them in the box, but it's kind of cool because... Um, uh, when I was a kid, I really liked the Star Barbie. Uh, I thought that she was a really cool doll. So it's kind of fun to be able to kind of mess with her hair a little bit and, and kind of actually, you know, actually touch her out of the box. So um, her hair is in, is in excellent condition. Um, she is missing all of her original clothing. I don't know if this bow is, um, is part of the original outfit. Um, I don't believe if, uh, that their ears were pierced either, so um, I don't think that she's missing any jewelry. Uh, the outfit that she's wearing is, it's pretty typical of a 70s, late 70s outfit, so I, that's why I just left her in it. It does look like it's handmade, doesn't look like it's uh, from, um, from Mattel. Um, and then uh, Star, uh, I think they're both marked on their backs right here, their lower back right here. And it says Mattel Incorporated 1979 uh, Philippines so she's in really good shape um, she does have a little bit of yellowing on her legs um, somebody must have had her in um, in a bright room um, and she kind of got a little bit discolored but it's not really it's not horribly bad it could it could also be just um, from over time of this type of plastic too I'm not too sure on the joints on this doll, um, kind of a little bit similar to the living Barbie. Um, she has that middle joint that's um, a ball joint in the waist. And then she's got ball joints um, in her shoulders and on her wrists. And then also, too, on her hips, she is ball jointed. This makes her really easy to display. I like this doll. I've always liked the star Barbie. And so you can see that, that her hip is also on, um, on a uh, ball joint. Uh, she has the three clicks just like a, like a Barbie would. And then she also has the um, kind of like the ball joint up here in her neck as well. So she's in pretty good shape. Probably missing, um, she's just missing all of her, um, all of her original clothing. And then the Tracy doll, she is also in good shape. Um, her hair is not cut. Uh, it just probably needs to, it's not in its um, original style, of course. But um, she's held together really well. She needs a little bit of cleaning. Um, she might be just a tiny bit faded in her eyes, but it could just be that it uh, needs to be a little cleaned out. So this may be her original outfit. I'm not too sure if her and Star wore the same thing. Um, like I said, I haven't done a lot of research on uh, the... the um, the Tracy doll for sure I don't know much about her um, but she's got the same joints as the star doll um, and the same marking there it is on her back there and she's actually got a little bit of a number above hers so she's also uh, 1979 from Mattel Incorporated and the Philippines but there's an extra number up there on her so it must be um, something to do with the mold number and then I do believe that these are also marked on their head as well Mattel 1979 and I think star has that as well and she does so these are star and Tracy 
If you guys like these dolls, please like and subscribe to my channel. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in my next video.